Oh, no. Go forward, go forward, go forward. Hey, what's going on everybody? Scorpion 939 here. Just uh, out in the wilderness for a uh, relaxing drive in my F-150 Raptor Edition. Bruh. Uh, I don't know if Raptor Edition is correct. I do know trucks. I drive an F-150 myself, but uh, as my daily driver in IRL. But, uh, yeah. Uh, what is this? This is a Raptor SID Ford Raptor SVT this mod uh, so this is spin tires if anyone doesn't know it's an awesome game I've had it in my library since I was in college actually and uh, I just didn't redownload it onto my new gaming PC here that I built and uh, oh god it's a, be it's a beautiful game and it's fun and the mods you can get for it are freaking awesome and so far this is like my daily driver of a truck I just love the damn thing uh, so we're gonna take a little tour we're actually um, so right now as you can see the map in spin tires, what you gotta do is see that thing right there, that cloaking? You have to take away all those before you can actually see the entire map, or you can just drive through it, and it creates these little... See how it's kind of highlighted right... I was just about to point at the fucking screen. <laughs> uh, um, see how it's actually kind of highlighted right there? Uh, that's where I've been when it was cloaking. And you can see I drove up through this field, just plowed right through the field and everything. Anyways, uh, the objectives of this game are to unlock the garages and uh, oh, there's another truck up there so we'll have to go look up there type C22 you can mod uh, different trucks into the game and cars and tractors and tanks and blah 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 I've only got the one truck in here right now I might get a couple more um, we'll have to see but um, basically you have two uh, objectives here you gotta there's logging objectives so there's a I'm really bad at using the controls for the map lumber right there there's lumber fuel log kiosk lumber and stuff like that uh it's been a while since i've played it and there's been a lot of new releases which is awesome oh shit going the wrong way uh so i'm way up here and we're actually going to go down here and check out this cloaking here try to get rid of it that's the last one i have to get so if i go down the road and hang a right so right up here we're going to hang a right let's put her up in automatic and like you can uh you can lock the diff uh go from all wheel to just two wheel drive which yeah, you just spin and stuff like the mud in this is extremely slippery, but it's still awesome. Uh, you got winches, you got trailers, you can customize the rims and tires on your trucks, you can do whatever you want, and you can take damage on your trucks too. Damage and fuel, that's. they, they exist. I'm not the best at this game, I've seen better people who really know how to go mudding, but. I don't know. So, um, I guess I have some explaining to do as to why I've been a ghost lately. Uh, I've had quite a few personal things going on in my life. Uh, actually, Wednesday of next week I'm going in for surgery on my ankle. Um, so, that this should be fun. <coughs> I'm going in for surgery on my ankle. I screwed up my ankle quite a, quite a while ago, uh, motocross racing. and The best part is... Oh, there's that cloaking right there. The best part is... is uh, I hurt my ankle falling down a hill. I just slipped and fell down a hill, and I heard this loud snap in my ankle, and that's how you're cloaking. So now I can see the rest of the map. Um, I fell down a hill, and I heard this loud snap, and I thought I broke my ankle, but I did. <laughs> I sure as hell did. I actually friggin' uh, tore a bunch of tendons, and that's what it was. It was the tendons snapping. So that sucks. Now I'm going in for surgery there Wednesday to actually get those replaced and fixed up. And yeah, so that's kind of been what's going on with me. I've been getting a lot of stuff set up with everything, so yeah. Um, so this is one of the logging places. This is where you, I think, drop logs off, I believe. Just going to tell me anything. Your truck? Yeah, I'm not carrying any logs. So this is where you drop logs off. Okay, so we're actually going to. I'm playing on the easy mode of the map right now. I'm not playing on the hard mode. Um, I want to get this truck back to that garage here. I could rescue it back, but like, where's the fun in that? Let's barrier through this water so we can make it. I haven't actually come through this part here. And I think, like, the lighter the water is, the sh more shallow it is. See how it's lighter over here? So that'd be probably a good spot because it's actually semi-light all the way up through it. Uh, I've come through here and over there. 
right now that's the truck that I want to use for the logging. So I might actually just back up, cut through there onto the road. Yeah, I'm gonna actually do that. Put her in reverse here. Let's see where we're fucking going. See, so yeah, anyone, so yeah, like I said, anyone who doesn't know this game, it's actually a lot of fun and definitely worth the buy. Um, it's just, it's entertaining with the mods you can put into it and the stuff like that. It's just so much fun. Oh, yeah, we're going to so. um, some of the stuff you can do with it's really cool. Like, it's weird though because like they even have like, I don't know, I don't know. You can get like a Subaru Outback or Outlander or whatever it is, or I don't know cars. That's my thing. I know trucks. I just don't know cars. But you can get so many weird ass mods, like a bulldozer, like bulldozers, uh, different types of tractors. Um, what else can we get? Uh, what do you think? Um, tanks. That's a weird. I said that already, but it's weird. You can actually get tanks and like fire and shit. Like you get a horn. And everything. <laughs> uh, what else? There's so many random shit that you can get. You, I'm pretty sure you can get like cranes, like random ass cranes for it. So it's weird, but kind of fun. I want to go left here. So we're gonna go back in my other logging truck, then we gotta take it back to the garage. But what I might do is I might, I'm not 100% sure how you unlock the garages. I think you, there's garage trailers, and I think you actually, what truck is this? Let's see, so you can switch to them. Okay, yeah, that truck. I think I have that twice, don't I? Oh, I gotta sneeze, hold on a second. Oh, I am good. I swear. I am good. Okay. Uh, that's not the truck I wanted. That's the C... Okay, I don't have it at the same time. Okay. Now, where the hell is my F-150? Where is there? Alrighty. Uh, Start it back up. And then you have parking brake winches and stuff, like I said. Uh, so on the road, it, it's really funny, too, because the road, you can go, like, full tilt. I'll even show you guys, because i got to take a pure repair me, but, like... You go full tilt and wait for it. You start taking random damage. It's like I got some back there, there's more. And it's so freaking slippery. Like the roads are, I swear, would be covered in mud. Like I'd just be going and then I'll cut it and then drift it. <laughs> it's, but in, in the end, it's an awesome game. I think that maybe they should change the roads to be a little less slippery. Maybe like actually pavement. But dude, they're slippery. It's ridiculous. All right, there's the truck that I want to use for the log. So I will park the Raptor here on this freaking trailer. I don't give a shit. And that trailer right there it just has a. It has what else? What does it have on it? It's got fuel and repair points, so you can actually fix your damage right here. And like you can see, I got a lot of fuel here and everything. So we'll stop that. Change truck. Start this old bitch up. Uh, we'll keep her in automatic, so it'll be easier for this. So now we're going to cross this here with water. This truck doesn't seem to have a problem going through the water. My uh, Raptor, though, I think it's like a no go put it in the low here. So yeah, I, I apologize for not having many videos here lately, guys. So that is my bad. So, yeah. Hell yeah, actually, this thing, this thing handles the water fine, but that Raptor, no, not so much. Alright, so I am actually going to cut here, and then when we get back to the garage, I'll show you guys how we can customize trucks and stuff like that, so we'll be right back. Uh, Alright guys, so here's a little clip showing you how bad the mud can get. Like, so like, see this doesn't look as bad, like I'm getting through it and everything, but like if you're in like high gear, and you start going through this stuff, uh, right now it's not showing it, damn it, let's get some fuel here and I'll show you, but like, if you get in a high gear, like you're just going through automatic and stuff, um, it will get you stuck. Like you just like you'll just start spinning and you won't be able to go anywhere. So like right now I'm actually trucking through it pretty freaking good. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I want to show <laughs> this truck's actually pretty good for getting through it. Once you get a trailer on it, it's a little more difficult. Uh, up here I might be able to show you. But there is time oh, I was just going for it. Oh, screw it. Uh, I don't think it's gonna do it. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get stuck. There has been times where I've just been given her, and the truck will just start spinning, and that's when you have to 
gear down and put her in below and just kind of crawl through it because that's the only way to freaking do it and if you put it up in uh, one plus I don't know that gear honestly um, you'll just stall your engine unless you're actually moving and then on the advanced mode if you do that with diff lock your truck will take a lot of damage yeah, like right here we're kind of we're just kind of spinning and we're going slow and it just be better off to be in low gear yeah everyone wants to go fast but like you can't always go fast in mud yeah right here look check that out see how much we slow down we're having to gear down see if we just stay in low we'll just crawl right through it no problem scare them birds out of here bastards <laughs> Yeah, then you can drop it up in high gear and buggy on down the road and give her shit into the pond. Sploosh. <laughs> it's such a fun game, dude. Like, yes, there's nighttime and everything. You got headlights and stuff. You turn them on, turn them off. I'm actually using a controller, so that makes my life a lot easier. Um, you can play on keyboard, and it works. Like, it, it does work perfectly fine. Where am I? Oh, yeah, the garage is right here. Um, the, the keyboard and mouse actually work perfect. Like, there's no problem with it at all. But the controller just feels a lot more fun. Yeah, I'm going to put her down here. And you can actually select the gear. Like, so you can go super low, medium, or high. That's what I'm going to say. But, like, super low is, like, you're, you're fucked and you need to get out. And then you can bump it up, get a little more speed out of it, slow down. Put her neutral and roll some coal. Just, oh yeah, squirt, 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 squirt. <laughs> All right, so here's the garage, and we'll show you guys what I mean by like customizing and stuff. Like right now, this truck's customized with a uh, semi-trailer hitch right there. Uh, you can put so many different types of things. I don't know if I want to haul short, medium, or long logs, but we'll have to see. Alright, so pull, you pull into this highlighted area anywhere you want. You want to have like good, sufficient, like flat land and stuff behind you and like a good length so you can actually hitch up your trailer. So I'll park right here. And then this HUD will pop up and then you just take your mouse and let's see. So you can get fuel canisters, uh, long log cart, garage parts, which that's what I think you use to unlock a garage. You see, that's two garage points. And uh, if I show you here, to unlock say this garage down here it says locked zero out of four and I think that's where you you just take garage parts over there so yeah I don't know now we're gonna go for now yeah, we have fireproof exhaust crane support so there's cranes in this I don't know how they work spare wheel which is extra shit I'm gonna put that on actually uh, utility trailer nope that's the one I have parked over across the water there. Garage, trailer, garage. So medium log cart. Um, why is that unavailable? Oh, I think I know why. Let's go. Tractor. What's that? Yeah, like you have to have certain things connected so you can get other things. That's the one. Available. Okay, tractor is that semi hitch. Um, let me think here. Carrier? Carry short logs, log cart, medium logs. Put that on there. No. I kind of want to get this medium log cart, which is that big, but I need what to do it. Cart with crane. Oh, it says right up here crane or log install. So. Oh, no, 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 no. Where's the crane carrier? Crane with carrier. Unavailable. Oh, wait. No, that's not on. I'm so confused. Spare wheel. Oh, spare wheel has to come off. Okay, okay. Crane with... No. Nope. Crane support. Okay, we gotta put that on first. No, let's find that. Uh, and you can do wheels and stuff too, which is cool. I don't think you can on this truck, but some trucks you can. Okay. Cart with crane. Crane support. Aha! There, there, and now let's go medium log cart. Oh yeah, we're ready for friggin' logging now, boys. So yeah, how the crane works, I don't know. I think I have to go we'll find it here in a second. We'll just pull out of this. Oh yeah, that looks good. Okay, now we'll go headlights on. I'll keep them off. I don't know if I like the headlights. Yeah, they bright up in front of you, 
But like, notice, like, look around you. You can see, and it dims it down. I don't know if I like that. So now, if I click my left bumper, yeah, here we go. Um, if I go, let's put push anchors. Oh no, position anchors. There we go. Push anchors, extend anchors. Oh no, I should probably push anchors first. Put them out. There we go. Crane grab. Oh shit. Uh, crane. I don't know what that's doing. It's putting something through the floor. Restore it. Uh, can I use? It? Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. So I use my mouse. Oh, it's like a li wait. What if I click? That's open, close. I think so okay, good. That makes it easier. I wouldn't want to fucking click that. Uh, uh, I think I broke it. It's not moving anymore. Oh. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Restore. Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we bring it over. I'm gonna get used to this controls. Just uh, position my camera a little better here. So that's pretty cool. I don't know if I remember this from before. No, oh, it's broken again. What the hell? I'm gonna use my keys. No, nope. Okay, we're gonna get this. We're gonna get this. This is just experiment time. Oh wait, C crane, and then yeah, that's what I was doing. I was yeah. I'm just, when I click uh, my gas pedal, or my gas key, I should say, on my control, it actually unselects it. So we can go out. Oh, fucking horn. Yeah, okay, okay. What else can we do? Let's just spin that up and down, left and right, and then that. Okay. Let's see why you have that. Now, that extends that out. Is there a way just to extend that out there? Maybe you don't need to. That does that. Okay, I understand. Okay, we're good. I think I can manage. We'll hop out of advanced and we'll drive out of here. It'd be a dumb idea to drive out of here with the support still down. Okay, push anchors, position anchors, and extend anchors. Ah. Crap. <laughs> Jesus, break it all the hell. Alright, we're good. So, uh, lumber, lumber, law. Okay, so it tells me where I have to go, so it's a very long way. Alright, we're gonna drive our asses over there, and we are going to load up and see what we can do. Be right back. Alright, so as we came from over here at our garage, we went all the way down this road, and I ended up actually turn, uh, cutting up through these this uh, set of woods here, up through here, over here, and boom, here we are. We're at the log kiosk. I don't know if the log kiosk is what I want, or the lumber. I see the log kiosk. I was actually messing around with this earlier, and it has... Uh, yeah, you can spawn different lumber. I don't know how. I think I might pick it up with a crane, but then if I pull it here, let's see what this does. As you can see, I have tracks through it because I just drove through here with my uh, F-150. Alright. Oh, can I just click load up? Load me up. Oh, by the Jesus. Don't even need the freaking crane. Uh, let's get out of here. Now let's see how easy this thing is to back up for. Too bad, actually. Ooh, we're kind of friggin'. No, I'm just gonna force it. It's alright. <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. Alright, so now we need to take it where? Does it give us an arrow where? Objective. Object. No, I'm not hauling it way the hell over there. Alright, so we'll hop back onto the main drag out here. We'll drive out here and hang a left. Out back on the main drag, drive down the old road here past the Ford Raptor, and then. That's the best way to get in here. Uh, probably go around the turn and up and back down here. Looks like the easiest way to do it. Alright, let's do it. <coughs> oh, hell yeah. Ooh, spinning. We 
Oh, yeah, spin it. Oh, drop. See, we're going spinning. Oh, get my gear shifter here. We'll just drop her down here. gear here. Just take her nice and slow. Sometimes, like, honestly, like I said, you got to go slow on this sometimes. Well, I got interrupted. Had to uh, cut the clip there. Um, yeah. So, um, we just pulled out of the driveway. And now we're going to, as I said, make our way down this road here. Down to a text message. Um, to the objective. So, let's see. Oh, parking brake's on. And I shouldn't need four-wheel drive and diff lock on the road, but I'll be honest, you never freaking know. Ooh, ooh. I don't know, man. This is pretty, I'm going to put diff lock on. Like, these roads are slippery as hell. Uh, what I like about this too, plugging my Xbox controller into my computer, it actually utilizes the rumble pack too, which is nice. So, if actually, if you guys hear any, like, things I swear I don't have a vibrator it is just my controller <laughs> what are we in for here and here oh, we're up auto. beating our feet down the road logs so those are medium logs uh, so I take it bigger logs would be the way to go if I guess if you want to complete an objective a lot faster uh, another thing I like about this game is when you're actually on the map <coughs> It actually looks quite big, but when you're driving through it, it's not too, too bad, which is nice. That's always quite enjoyable. We're doing alright on fuel, we're doing 100 meters. Coming up to the old Raptor. Bitch just parked right here. Oh. That just dropped. <laughs> what the hell? I put the feet up on it. God, that's a nice truck. I love that look. I'm going to run into the damn thing. There we go. It's such a nice truck. I don't know. I just love it. Oh, I'm going to see if I can get some... Um, I might even do like a mod showcase of like... You've got to be kidding me. Okay, don't move. This is what I get for looking at the truck. This is what I get. Uh, I don't know what to do. Okay, um... Two options. I, are those tires still spinning? Yeah. Um, I can hook the f Raptor onto the RCN to hold it down, or I can try to get out of it myself. I believe if I tip over, my logs will fall off. Oh no! Go forward! Go forward! Go forward! Oh. <sighs> Fuck. I'm not, I'll be honest, I'm pretty upset right now. I am pretty freaking upset. Uh, okay, let's... Vanched winch. Click. Seriously, all I can hook onto is the trailer? I can't hook onto the damn truck? I should be able to. Um... Nope, trailer. Uh, I don't know if I can do this, man. Let's see if we can bring her over this way. Oh, God, that's disappointing. I don't think I'm doing anything right now. No way I'm actually doing anything right now. Fuck. <laughs> I just had to look at the truck. It's all, I just, it's a pretty truck. Like, look at it, it's pretty, but I just had to look at it. God damn it, dude. I, sh I feel like I should be able to fucking winch up on this thing, but like, apparently not. Uh, there we go. Oh, yeah. Let's put her in. Come on. 
Come on. Dangerous water level, really? I don't think this thing can pull it. There is a way to... Um... Come on. Let's just give her a big jerk here. Something. God, I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, I don't think this thing's gonna be able to pull it. Fuck. Okay, let's try this. Change track. Advanced. Winch. Can I not winch it while it's upside down? I thought he could do that for like safekeeping. Oh no. Wrong camera view. Um. I'm actually so stupid. Like, I'm actually kicking my ass for doing this. Um. Turn the parking brake off, I guess. Wait, what truck am I? Yeah, I'm in this truck. Okay, yeah. It's just not letting me. There. Yeah, she's just gonna stall. Um. Hmm. What to do? What to do? Cameras are kind of scurry on this as well, which is weird, but hey. Okay, no, stop it. You hook to. I can winch back there, I guess. Reef that thing. Oh! Shit! I was doing something. Trailer detached. Man, that's probably not a bad thing. Pull it out of there then if it's detached. Oh, no, it, okay, it fell. Very best. Oh, I'm just causing all sorts of freaking problems here. I might even be better off flipping it completely over, so I'm just gonna pull myself down in the water and actually back up. Uh, let's go over here. There we go. I might be better off just trying to flip it this way. Yeah, I can't flip it uphill. I'm trying to start the fucking one. Come on. Come on. Nope, I'm going to have to get a bigger truck. So... With that disappointment, guys, we are going to end the episode here. Um, yeah, I screwed up big time. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, if you like this video, uh, make sure to drop a like and subscribe because there will be more of this to come, actually, because of uh, getting back into this game has been a lot of fun. So I'll definitely be playing more and doing some mod showcases and maps and so forth and so on. So if you like it, let me know, guys, and uh, we will... See y'all later. Peace, guys.